So what I'm going to put in here, kind of like fins maybe. Whoops. Alt, not Alt A. Control A, set to location. Put that back in the middle. Size. All right. G Z. G Z. And so I'm just going to go through create something something just to fill this gap Oops. all right so let's create a small plate and I'm gonna push this up scale it what we'll do is I'm gonna grab this face I'm gonna extrude but let's grab these two fa this two vertices here. And so now I've kind of got this bin, I guess, like a cooling fin. Okay. So what we can do is I can go add modifier and rather than copying and pasting everything across uh, to make kind of like a set of fins, I'm going to set an array. And at the moment, the it's only on one on the x-axis. Probably going to 1.5, so there's a slight gap. Let's move it over. And... Yeah, 10. Let's throw a bevel on. And uh, let's just expand that so it's a little bit longer so it actually touches the edges edges and so probably to save them vertices what we can do is we can go select them delete face delete face delete face so now yeah that's looking not too bad mm, is there anything else that we should be able to do here so probably what would be a good idea is to make so those cables aren't just going into the nether ether. I'm going to select this, um, our, what do we call them? Stands before. And I'm going to shift A, cylinder. Let's bring that down so I can see what I'm looking at. Okay, G, about there, shift D, shift D, let's select these all again, control L, 7, I mean 1, okay, and they sit about there, does that look nice, that doesn't look too bad. Let's move that one over. G Y. Yeah, but now that looks like that's got some purpose. Now the next bit will be, let's create this item here for where those cables are going. 